Sarah, let me throw out some hypothetical uh, facts. I'll get a little more specific. Nothing happens during the day. Jury comes in, they go home, there's testimony, there's arguments, etc. But at night, when all the jurors are at home, there is word that there's violence in the streets and there's a clash between police and citizens, which is exactly what this trial is about. What do they do? Again, you know, worst case scenario, we really hope that we do not see more violence born out of what is already a, a case riddled with violence. You know, if that happens, safety is number one. You know, we don't want anybody to be hurt, whether that be citizens, law enforcement, jurors, judges, family members, witnesses, et cetera. And so if that happens at night and the trial needs to be, you know, paused until safety is restored, you know, it, that could be a possibility. But again, you know, this story is sad enough as it is. It is really my hope that we don't see more violence born out of violence on the streets of Minneapolis. Personally, I don't think it's going to happen. That's why I'm just playing a what-if game and to see how it could potentially impact what's happening inside the court.